visiting Canada in 2024, understanding the visa process. Canada welcomes millions of visitors each year. People come to explore its beautiful landscapes and vibrant cities. Before booking a trip, it's important to understand Canada's visa requirements. Many nationalities need a visitor visa to enter Canada. The process starts with an online application. Applicants provide personal information and travel details. They also need to prove they meet certain criteria. This includes having enough money for their stay and a return ticket. The Canadian government carefully reviews each application. They check for potential risks, including security concerns. Applicants may be asked for additional documents or an interview. The entire process can take several weeks or even months. Once a visa is granted, it allows a temporary stay in Canada. The allowed duration varies but is usually six months. It's crucial to respect the visa conditions and leave before it expires. Overstaying a visa can have serious consequences. Denied entry common reasons for deportation at Canadian airports. Arriving at a Canadian airport with a visa doesn't guarantee entry. Border officials have the final say. They assess each visitor to ensure they meet the requirements for entry. There are many reasons why someone might be denied entry and deported. One common reason is insufficient funds. Visitors must prove they can support themselves during their stay. This means showing bank statements or credit card limits. If officials doubt the visitor's financial stability, they may refuse entry. Another reason is providing false or misleading information. This includes lying about the purpose of the visit or past criminal history. Canadian authorities have access to extensive databases. They can easily verify the information provided. Visitors must also demonstrate their intention to leave Canada before their visa expires. A return ticket is usually sufficient proof. However, officials may investigate further if they suspect the visitor plans to stay illegally. Real-life deportation cases. A stark reminder of strict entry rules. Violating Canada's immigration rules can be severe. Numerous cases highlight strict border control measures. A family from Europe was deported at Toronto Pearson Airport. They had valid visas but failed to declare a large sum of cash. Carrying over $10,000 must be declared. Their failure raised suspicions of money laundering. Despite pleas, they were sent back. Another case involved a student misrepresenting his intentions. He claimed tourism but had documents for work. Officials deemed it a visa violation. He was denied entry and banned for five years. These cases show Canadian authorities prioritize border integrity. Visitors must be truthful and transparent. Deceiving officials can lead to serious repercussions. New regulations and updates. Navigating Canada's evolving immigration landscape in 2024. Canada's immigration policies are constantly evolving. It's essential for potential visitors to stay updated on the latest regulations. In 2024, several significant changes have been implemented. These changes aim to strengthen border security and streamline the application process. One major update is the expanded use of biometrics. Most visitors now need to provide fingerprints and a photograph. This data is collected at visa application centers and upon arrival in Canada. It helps authorities confirm identities and prevent fraud. Another change is the introduction of electronic travel authorizations, ETAs. Citizens of eligible countries can apply for an ETA online. It's linked to their passport and allows multiple entries for up to five years. This simplifies the process for frequent travelers. Furthermore, the Canadian government has increased its focus on online security. Applicants must be cautious about sharing personal information online. It's crucial to use official government websites and avoid fraudulent websites or agencies. Section 5. Avoiding Deportation. Tips and advice for a smooth entry into Canada. While navigating Canada's immigration system can seem daunting, there are steps visitors can take to increase their chances of a smooth entry. By following these tips, travelers can minimize the risk of encountering problems at the border. First and foremost, ensure all documents are in order. This includes having a valid passport, visa if required, and supporting documents. Double-check expiry dates and ensure all information is accurate and consistent. Secondly, be prepared to answer questions about the purpose of the visit. Officials may inquire about accommodation, itinerary, and ties to the home country. Providing clear and concise answers can help alleviate any concerns. 
It's also wise to pack light and avoid carrying prohibited items. Familiarize yourself with Canada's customs regulations. Declare any goods that require declaration and be honest about the value of your belongings. Section six, the importance of compliance, ensuring a positive Canadian experience. Respecting Canada's immigration laws is not just a legal obligation, but also a matter of ensuring a positive experience. By adhering to the rules, visitors contribute to the integrity of the system and foster a welcoming environment. Compliance demonstrates respect for Canadian sovereignty. It shows that visitors acknowledge and value the country's laws and regulations. This respect is essential for maintaining positive relations between Canada and other nations. Moreover, following the rules ensures a smoother and more enjoyable trip. Avoiding delays, interrogations and potential deportation allows visitors to focus on exploring Canada's beauty and culture. Ultimately, compliance benefits everyone involved. It protects the safety and security of Canadians and visitors alike. It also maintains the efficiency and fairness of the immigration system. Section 7. Seeking Professional Guidance. Navigating the Complexities of Canadian Immigration. Navigating the complexities of Canadian immigration can be challenging, especially for first-time visitors. Seeking professional guidance from an immigration consultant or lawyer can provide invaluable assistance and peace of mind. Immigration consultants are regulated professionals with expertise in Canadian immigration law. They can assess individual circumstances, provide personalized advice, and assist with the application process. They can also help prepare for interviews and address any concerns. Lawyers specializing in immigration law offer an even higher level of legal expertise. They can represent clients in court if necessary and provide legal counsel on complex immigration matters. Their services are particularly valuable for individuals facing deportation or other serious issues. While professional guidance comes at a cost, it can be a worthwhile investment. It can save time, reduce stress, and increase the chances of a successful outcome. When choosing a consultant or lawyer, ensure they are licensed and reputable. Section 8. The Human Cost of Deportation. Stories from Visitors Denied Entry. Behind the statistics and legal complexities of deportation lie real human stories. Being denied entry to Canada can have devastating consequences for individuals and families. One heartbreaking story is that of a young couple who saved for years to visit Niagara Falls. Their joy turned to despair when they were denied entry due to a visa misunderstanding. In another case, an elderly woman was deported after traveling from India to visit her son. Despite her son's pleas, she was sent back alone and heartbroken. These stories highlight the human cost of deportation. Section 9. Canada's Evolving Immigration Policies – Balancing Security with Openness Canada prides itself on being a welcoming and multicultural nation. However, the country also faces the challenge of balancing its openness with the need for security and border control. This balancing act is reflected in Canada's evolving immigration policies. On the one hand, Canada recognizes the social and economic benefits of immigration. The country welcomes skilled workers, international students, and refugees. These newcomers contribute to Canada's diversity, workforce, and cultural fabric. On the other hand, Canada must also address concerns about security threats, illegal immigration, and human trafficking. The government implements measures to screen visitors, enforce immigration laws, and protect its borders. Finding the right balance between openness and security is an ongoing process. Canada's immigration policies are constantly reviewed and adjusted to reflect changing circumstances and priorities. Section 10. Conclusion, understanding your responsibilities as a visitor to Canada. Visiting Canada can be an enriching and memorable experience. However, it's crucial to remember that entering another country comes with responsibilities. Understanding and complying with Canada's immigration rules is essential for a smooth and enjoyable trip. By familiarizing yourself with visa requirements, preparing all necessary documents and being truthful and transparent throughout the process, you can increase your chances of a successful entry. Seeking professional guidance when needed can also provide valuable assistance. 
Remember that respecting Canada's immigration laws is not only a legal obligation, but also a matter of respect for the country and its people. By following the rules, you contribute to a welcoming environment for all visitors. Before embarking on your Canadian adventure, take the time to educate yourself about your responsibilities as a visitor. By doing so, you can ensure a positive and memorable experience in this beautiful and diverse country.